All right, everyone, welcome back again. We just finally met up with the Crooked Man and we managed to shut him out here. And I'm hoping. Wrong button, hold on. I'm hoping we can at the very least move something to block that damn trap door now, but we can't. By the way, I'm finally using a controller for this game. I was using keyboard last time I was playing, so if I'm like activating the menu a lot, it's because I keep pressing the wrong button. I keep thinking X is to confirm, but X is actually for the menu and squares to confirm. All right, let's get out of here. I don't know where I'm going now. Hmm. Locked. Okay. Do I get out of here? Oh wait, I'm supposed to meet uh, with this girl, right? Who is not here? Oh crap! W was that sissy? Okay, well now that's great. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Uh, sissy? Sissy? Hold on, I'm coming. Sissy? No? Okay. No? No? Sissy's not here? Sissy? No? Sissy? No? Okay. No? No go, no go. Maybe on the other side? Maybe the East Hall? Oh god, that was scary. No? Def definitely not. Definitely not there. <laughs> I like have to knock through every door. Don't tell me it's in the same hall I was in. That'd be crazy. Alright, we're gonna have to check the same hall then. I can't believe it. No. Sissy? Sissy! What happened? I... I went to the window and the floor gave way. W what should I do? Sissy, jump over. It's dangerous over here. Uh, no, I can't. I'm slipping. And I can't possibly jump that far. The gap is this big. This is no time for pessimism. It's gonna crumble soon. Hurry, I'll catch you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that was too close. Are you okay, Sissy? Are you hurt? Sissy? So scared. I was so scared. No more. I, I don't like the dark. Why? Why do I? I... It's okay, Sissy. I'm sorry. I know you were scared, but it's fine now. Don't cry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was scared and confused. It's alright. I'm glad you're not hurt. Did you find what you were looking for? No, not yet. I wasn't in the room we stayed in. I wonder where it could be. It must be important if you came out by yourself. You could always just give up on it. It's not entirely safe here. I can't give up on it. I have to find it. What exactly is it? Sorry to ask, but I've just been wondering. Was it a present or... It's a present from my boyfriend. It's the most important thing to me. After my own life. Ah, I see. Sorry if I was rude. I'll keep looking for it too. You're looking for someone, right? I haven't met anyone yet, but can you tell me more about them? Uh, well, I don't know that much either. Just that he's a man about my age. Huh. You know that little about the person you're looking for? You're a strange guy, David. I'm not. There's just some things I want to ask, and I don't know how he looks because, uh... Strange, but very kind. I would have been hurt badly if you weren't here. I'm really grateful for you for saving me. I should get going. Take care, David. I'll see you. You might want to tell her about the crooked man. I'm just saying. Okay, I guess we're leaving. Hotel register. Do you want me to go back in there? Because I don't want to. The basement door's open. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
crap, 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 crap. He was coming back out. Oh no. Um, and you want me to explore? Can I get out? Oh, you're so stupid. Why? All right. Well. All right, let's light her up. All right, since this area is now abandoned by this dude, is there anything else here I need to find? Oh, yep, something's here. What's this? Bronze key. Okay, we got a key now. Perfect. All right, this whole time I need to go back down there. All right, ah, uh, bronze key. I think if I unlock this area here, this, uh, wait, no, maybe it's in the upper east wing then, there was a doorway, might be this one over here, yeah, this one, there you go, oh, that was weird, a bar, a journal seemingly written by a staff member, the last page is rambling and slappily written. A toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we've got. Hell, it's the only good thing here. Being out of a job's no good, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We were so sick of that egghead always trying to flaunt his intelligence. Installing weird stuff for the basement door, having a number lock on the food storage, all his silly crap made the place impossible to run. Plus, the Pasco was, the, was this thing with a book, which he changed up every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him, but sure as hell not us. Okay, so a passcode was this thing with a book, which he changed up every month. Ah, whatever. Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. A toast to our bright futures. The door to the food storage is all is at the far end of the first floor, right? A passcode on food is pretty absurd. Okay. Anything else we need here? Can I get a drink? I might need one after seeing that dude. Freaking floorboards collapsing. Oh, wait. Line with novels. Those are maps. Administration. Shelves are empty. A phone. Um, do I need to go back again down there? I hope not. have to right ah there we go one more time nothing left in there i hope all right so i can't go in there perfect oh book of the month the strange case of dr jekyll and mr hyde book of the month where to oops wrong button nope wrong button q to r okay t the blackboard in the owner's room said the strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Be on this shelf, right? Ah, here we go. Chapter 1. Story of the Door. Mr. Utterson, the lawyer, was a man of a rugged countenance that was never lighted by a smile. Cold, scanty, and embarrassing discourse. Lovable. Okay, what's the other stuff? Chapter 2. Search for Mr. Hyde. Okay. Chapter 4. Chapter 5. Chapter 8. Chapter 10. Henry Jekyll's fullest statement of the case. So I'm assuming I got the, the code already then. Did it get darker? Alright, hold on. Chapter 1. So we got one, two, the Karoo murder case, four, five, eight, ten. Okay. I might have to. Oh, God. What? No way. 
That monster? Did it really? Time to go. It's coming this way. Crap. I gotta escape. Go, 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 go. Maybe if I drop him down here. What is that monster? So what I saw earlier really was to think that thing actually exists. I'm not gonna lie guys, I was trying to jump down, not have him, but that works out too. But still, there's no way it's coming back from that fall and the room under here is locked tight. I should warn Sissy when I see her. I knew it'd be dangerous for her. All right, first and foremost, we're, we're saving that one, that run button again. Uh, yeah. There you go. I will do this. There you go. Oh my god. Okay. So we got the passcode, right? Let me see how that works out. Change number. Okay. Um, hmm. I might need to look at the thing again. How far do these numbers go? Mm hmm. Randomize it. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, three, six, seven, nine. Okay, that worked. You see something shining, but it's out of reach. I need a chair. Smells rotten. Rotten. What can I use here? Can I use that knife? A small fruit knife. A rusty pot. The wax hold tableware and cooking utensils. Casket seems empty. Hold on. Can I go around? Can I? Beer cases. Wooden box. A wooden box. Oh, ladder. Perfect. I could use this to get up to that thing. Two oh nine. Beautiful. Anything in the trash? No. Okay, two oh nine. God, I don't. <laughs> I got so lucky on that one. That was hilarious. Hold on. Yep, two or nine at the end. A locked door. But broken plate. Shelves are empty. Dresser's empty. Looks like something was badly burnt. Was this a photo? There's something under the pieces. Found a scrap from a notebook. I don't need her memory anymore because I know she won't come back. I have to erase everything, good and bad, and all the memories inside of me too. Ah! My head hurts! Ah, it's easing up. Sheesh, I'm exhausted. I guess I haven't slept much. So he burnt this photo to mend his broken heart, huh? I know I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Never. According to Paul, that makes me a pansy. Sissy! Oh, there you are, David. Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are lots of rooms I can't get into, so it might be in one of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. Oh, it's nothing. But Sissy, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier. You'd definitely be in danger too, so I think you should go. Look, I don't like dark, scary places either, but there's no need to tease me like that. I'm not a kid afraid of the boogeyman, okay? Uh, sorry, but I'm not trying to tease you. I'm telling the truth. <laughs> don't worry, I'm not mad. You don't seem like a dishonest guy, so I'd like to believe you, but... A monster? Maybe you mistook something in the dark. 
You can be susceptible to seeing things when you wander around the dark like this. Believe me, sissy, I was not susceptible to anything. It had a long, crooked neck. I like to think you're right. Alright, if you insist, but be careful, okay? I also pushed him down a hole. From the upper floor. I know. Well, I'll go looking elsewhere. Or, hear me out for a second, sissy. We don't split up. But you're gonna leave me anyway, okay? Fantastic. Thank you, sissy. One button. Dresser's empty. Empty. Okay. Save again. Instant save. I love it. Alright. What? You want me to go in there? Oh, there's blood. I see blood. Red writing. Was this here before? Pl leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Come to me. I am waiting for you. Sounds pretty inconsistent. Who could have written this? I'll get the hell out of here. Why? I dropped it down a pit. Crap, I gotta do something. Um, the oak crap. Screw- Oh! Game over. Yeah, sounds about right. Alright, come on. Come on. Oh crap, that thing can like freaking jump. Go, go, go! I'll be caught if I go in there. Yep, you're right. Let's get out of here. Oh my god! <laughs> he ran! Uh, I can't outrun him. Last, do I have anything here? Beer bottles. Empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles. A few wine bottles, they seem to be full. Brandy, got tons of alcohol in it. I might just catch fire if I drink. Oh, got you. Now I know what I need to do. Right, let's go, let's go. I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's go. Oh, hold on. Damn it. This monster doesn't give up. How about some of this? Ah, I guess that won't do much alone. What else can I do? Ah, uh, this. Oh, yeah. Now that he's covered in alcohol, he should be plenty flammable. Take that. He ran away. Whew. Why the hell is that thing? Why is it chasing me? How did it survive before? I might need something to defend myself. Even just a knife could really help. Was there one of those around? Yes, there was. It was in... What room was it? Downstairs. Lower West End. This area, I remember. Yep, there's that knife. That was weird. A fruit knife. Maybe I should take it just for self-defense. Can I equip it? Hold on. Let's save first. And then we're gonna... Out. I'm gonna check my item. And I guess it's automatically equipped, I guess? I don't know. More blood? Great. Blood? This wasn't here earlier. Did, did something happen to Sissy? Uh-oh. 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 Up top? Down below? No, over here. Follow the trail. Over... Wait, here? It's by Sissy? 
Sissy, what are you doing here? Whoa, your arm's bleeding. So it was your blood. Were you hurt? My arm caught on something. It's not that big of a deal. Don't worry about it. It's bleeding a lot though, and you've been resting here, right? What if you get anemia? I'm just a little tired. I've been walking around a lot. Really, don't worry about it. Give me your hand, sissy. I have a handkerchief, so I can at least try to wrap it up. I guess this is better than nothing. Doesn't hurt? It's fine. Thank you. You're so kind, David. You don't seem so well. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. I've just been so silly. Silly? It's silly that I'm wandering this dark place all alone, falling in the holes, cutting my arm, all to find some measly box. Measly? But it's important, right? A memento from your boyfriend. Well, he's my ex, to be exact. Huh? He left me quite a while ago, but while we were dating, this hotel was our special place. Oh, so that was... So he's talking about you then. Are you dead? <laughs> that was when I lost the box. I've been worried about it ever since, but I only just worked up the courage to come look. I think she is dead. I think I read it earlier. I thought I could forget everything about him, but it was no good. Coming here just brought back all these memories. Why did you break up? I don't know. Maybe that's why I won't give up. He said he appreciated my kindness, but when we broke up, he said it was all I had. And he was exactly right, so I couldn't reply. I really am a wimp. No wonder he'd break up with me. Even I hate a girl like me. Sorry, I know I'm just annoying you. I'll rest here a while longer. I'm a little dizzy. Thanks for your help, David. Oh, and here, I found this. I'm not sure where it goes, though. Thanks. Don't strain yourself, okay? Well, I'm going. So we're just gonna leave her? Is that how it works? Oh boy. Okay. I got a key to somewhere. Why are you always like this, David? Like, like what? You're always such a yes man, just going with the flow. Do you even have a personality? I don't mean to. I mean, I try to think for myself. I don't see it that way. You're not kind. You're just indecisive. You treat anyone else the same way, right? That's why I can't trust you. Look, please just listen. I'm always thinking of you. If I'm a pain, then I'm sorry. There you go again, thinking you can just apologize and everything will be fine. You don't understand a word I'm saying. Then what should I do? You just don't trust me, is that it? Maybe it's hopeless for us. I hate for it to end this way, but I think we would both be worse off staying together any longer. Thanks for everything, David. Goodbye. Wait, we can talk this out, surely! Wow. Kindness is all you have. Sissy and I are the same like that, timidly refusing to forget. The moment I realized she didn't love me, I felt like I was nothing but worthless. I wonder if Sissy felt that way too. Wow. Um, okay, we got a key to something. We're gonna open it. Wherever that key opens up to. That that way? Not this room? Maybe this room? Finally? Ah, at long last. Something shiny. We're outside again. Something's in the fountain. The music box! Maybe this is the one Sissy lost. It must be. It's decorated with rubies. Did someone throw it away here or what? Man, I'm glad I found it. I'll get this to Sissy pronto. Alright, now uh, wander around a bit just to see. Okay. Um, again, one more time because we can quick save. We don't want to die right away for no reason. Alright, Sissy, I got you. You'll be so surprised. <laughs> huh, did Sissy leave already? But she's wounded. 
Sissy. Oh. Hold on, hold on a second, hold on a second. Super save. Okay. Let's go. I'm coming, sissy! Ah, uh, where'd you scream from? Lower west end? Upper? God, I hope you're somewhere here. No. No. Here? Of course not. Nope. 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 God. <laughs> you know, this would be like a comedy if you're like trying to save someone and you're knocking through every door. Sissy! Ah! No! Stay away! Stop right there! Back off, monster! David! Damn it! Sissy, get out of the hotel! D David, what are you? I said run away. I'll take care of this. Hey, monster. I don't know what the hell you are, but don't you lay a finger on Sissy. Now we're saving. Saving up. Okay, we're gonna die. We're here to die. Okay, let's go. No, let's go. No, no you don't. No, come on. Ow. Come on. No. No. No, you don't. Let's take it. Did I win? David. I won. David. David, are you okay? Yeah, I don't think he'll chase us anymore. But never mind me. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm not hurt. But... Sissy, what's wrong? Are you not feeling well? Why? Why did this happen? Why did I have to go through this? Why did that horrible monster attack me? I... I just didn't want to forget him. I just wanted to have my memory of him at least. Is it because I'm such a wimp? Is that why this happened? Can I... Can I not even love him? No, I hate it. Someone... Somebody help. Sissy. Please don't cry. Well, what's wrong with being a wimp? You may not feel like a sissy for not being able to forget him, but is that such a bad thing? David. You know, I was dumped a few months ago too. I was sure we were going to get married. You too? I was dejected. Even now it still pains me. I don't think I can truly forget it. I've always hated how I was such a coward. I'm a miserable excuse for a man, especially in romance. I couldn't even be happy when my friend got married, and it made me hate myself more and more. But looking at you, I've come to think. Maybe it's not bad to keep thinking of someone. In fact, maybe it's a wonderful thing. I decided I wouldn't give up either, and it's thanks to you, sissy. Thank you. David. This is your treasure, right? It's a pretty fancy box. It'd be a shame to throw it away. Take good care of it, okay? I'm sure the one you love will understand, and I know I'll always support you. Thank you, David. I... I'll try a little harder. I hope things go well for you, too. Hey, David? Did the box come with a key? A key? No, I didn't see one. Strange. The box needs a key to open, so... Though I didn't lock it. A key... Wait, hold on. Maybe this brass key... <laughs> nah, of course not. Oh, yes, that's the one. Where'd you find it? 
Really? I picked it up around here. A key from my house opened Sissy's box? So the former tenant's involved with the box. What does that mean? Well, it pretty much means that the former tenant is the boyfriend, the ex. I wonder why it was locked. Let's open it. Oh, there's a piece of paper. That's... Sissy, can I look at that? I thought so. It matches with the notebook pages, which means he... I don't get it, but I guess the guy you're looking for put this paper in here. Seems that way. It has an address on it. Another one? Are you going there, David? Yeah, he wasn't here, so I'll check there next. Okay, be careful. I'll escort you home, sissy. It's dark out after all. I'll be alright. Thanks though, David. Well... I'm really thankful, David. Let's see each other again sometime. What? My boy got a kiss? Th that surprised me. <laughs> but she seems happier now. That's good. I feel a little more relaxed myself. Lingering scent of dreams. And is this an address? Maybe that's where he is now. I'll go check it out. I've come this far. Until I find him, I'll go anywhere. Uh, no, we shouldn't. We should stop now while we're ahead. We just fought a freaking weird monster. But we're gonna go anyway. Hotel Ruinheim, Sissy. End. Save. Alright. Alright guys, I'm going to end the video here for today. Thank you all for watching. That was pretty fun. I wasn't expecting to actually have some uh, combat in the game. I thought we were just going to be running away. And turns out we can actually uh, fight back and I like that. Then again, it actually uh, makes sense considering it shows a health bar on our character. So good to know. And all in all, I'm enjoying this game. So if anything else, we'll continue on in the next one. So thank you again for watching.